culture, 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 culture. And it was something very new and edgy. And like you said, bringing fashion and music and all these things, which in our town of Greenville, like, I don't know if anybody's doing that. Like, not just any gym, but I don't know if any business period or any organization period is is doing it and doing it the way that you're doing it. So where did that come from, this like this idea of building this culture and this idea of doing stuff that was so different? I'm going to spend a great portion of this life. Yeah. You and I only have so many breaths. Mm-hmm. And if I'm going to spend a lot of them working, then I'm going to be in a culture and an atmosphere that I love. Yeah. It must be the beard wagging down. Wait a minute, nope, it's his ego! (laughs) There's not very many organizations that can say that it's 100% about the people in the field that are doing the work every day. Those are the people that need to be rewarded. And you believe it, but with this, it's 100% that. I'm very fortunate to be in this office, usually only on Fridays, because I'm on the road still, four days a week. Uh, but when I'm here, like every single decision that's made, every single one of those arguments with JB is about that. It's about protecting the field. It's not about protecting them, but it's one and the same. But by, by them trying to protect to make sure that nothing happens to where the people that are out there putting in the work are ever affected. I mean, there's, there's no better leadership within an organization on this planet. And I was telling Luigi, because he just got here uh, today, he's just getting to know everybody. Hi. I'm like, I'm like, I can't wait for you to see this culture that we have this weekend. And it was the perfect day for him to come in to see all this. I was like, because it can't be described. That was how we, we came at it, Jeff and Nathan and myself, um, in the very beginning. And it started with just us. Mm-hmm. And it started with, um, you know, we, you hear that, that uh, saying, families that eat together stay together. Yeah. We started, you know how we do our whole company and we have a meal together and we all come mm-hmm. up with ideas and stuff like that to, yeah. to further the bottom line and, yep. and, and have everybody engaged. Well, that started with me and Jeff and Nathan. Yeah. So something about culture is whatever your culture is, it's got to be consistent. Yeah. And when you create that, you just have to determine what type of company you want. So I, I remember, sorry, I remember I remember sitting and thinking that um, I, how Google did their culture, how they had the nap pods and all the fun yeah. stuff and yeah. all that kind of thing. And I thought, well, I want to have a fun atmosphere. And so it really has to start from the top. It has yeah. to start from the inception. And if there's a company that doesn't have it, then you have to get your, your key people and your direct reports and you've got to lay the law down on the company culture or the mm-hmm. company mission, vision, and values first. 